I ask you about today is the issue of respite services, particularly in the North West. I know you have answered questions previously uh, from, from Deputy McSherry in regard to CAMS, which is a similar service, and there are issues with both of them. But the respite service in particular, and there are people in here today that have met Minister McGrath in relation to it, while we can quote summary statistics across the country, the reality is that in many areas, for many families, they are not getting a service. We have people in Sligo and in the North West that have not got respite for over a year. Will you ensure that the adequate provision is put in place? Really what we need to see here is we need to see more resources put into these black spots. And there are a couple of black spots around the country. Kerry is another one, which we have another problem in. But particularly in the North West, the Sligo, the Solace Centre has been closed down and has been put into residential you, care where it was a purpose-built respite service. Will you ensure that it can be reopened and that decision is reversed? Thank you. Deputy Scanlon on the same matter, 30 seconds. Respite services in the North West, particularly in Sligo, where we had a state of the art centre built at a cost of 1.35 million six years ago, specifically built for that purpose. That's been closed now, I understand, going to be used for decongregation, which is very, very unfair for the service users that was using that. Now they have to travel 320 kilometres round trip to Carrick Macross in County Monaghan. Anybody that needs uh, respite services in Sligo. I think it's absolutely outrageous to have people forced into that situation. I think it's very wrong. And I, 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 I agree with uh, Deputy Kenny, that centre in Sligo, which was specifically built, should be opened up again for the people of the North West. Thank you. Um, cert certainly in 2018, additional resources will be provided for respite care. And I think that's uh, something of enormous importance uh, that um, uh, family carers in particular uh, um, are able to take a break uh, and are able to avail of respite. And even though the respite care grant, or the care support grant, uh, as it's now called, has been fully restored, um, many people uh, still can't avail of respite because of the, um, uh, the, the difficulties in, in supplying it uh, in many parts of the state. Uh, but obviously, if that funding is increased, it will be a matter not for me but for uh, the HSC to um, decide how it's allocated around the country. So it's perhaps something uh, that would best be direct raised with Minister Harris. Oh, we're three deputies off.